we kind of plan and meet up and it's really a wonderful place here with Bernard and his girlfriend from Lithuania. The only problem is when he arrived, he took the wrong way and here what happened. On our way to Toledo first, but it seems it's a beautiful town. We probably gonna skip Madrid. We really don't like big cities. We prefer small cities, small town and also in the nature like these kind of places. So we're almost ready to go and uh, this, I can say this part of Spain, it's beautiful drive, really nice roads you want to stay here no huh? you want to come with us oh no don't leave me here oh. come on come on he played a potato bag sometime i have to just take him as like a potato bag so that's our potato bag Supermarket, Mercadona, just because Lidl and Eurospeed, for example, were not so popular. I mean, you can find, but this seems pretty much the uh, Spanish discount from what I heard. So we're gonna just go in and compare prices. Let's see what we can buy. It seems pretty big. A lot of meat, as you can see. And I have to cook today, so I'm the chef in the back, and I speak by myself. Yep. Hello, Keith. Okay, just go down. Doggy. Uh, we brought some food. Come on. You stay there. So, I got for today or for tomorrow, actually, for today, ta -da! pizza. I know you like it. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the captain speaking. Welcome aboard to these WDN van lines. Today we're gonna drive from Mora de Debre. Mora what? Mora Debre. Ebre, mm. I think it's the river, to an unknown point on the map. The temperature outside is 70 degrees. During the drive we can offer you snacks and uh, cold beverages and drinks. 
non-alcoholic drinks. Please fast your seatbelt and uh, and what? <laughs> and watch out for crazy drivers. But Spain, it's pretty. Uh, people drive well here. I mean, we're you've only screamed twice this morning. Yes, so it's already an accomplishment. Amazing places, I love it. Well, this is the place and it's kind of beautiful. So look at the beauty, Mork and the river, it's beautiful, it's magic. The only problem is when he arrived, he took the wrong way, and here what happened. The International Lithuanian Czech Republic and the van it's still there, it's stuck in the mud. We'll see. Hopefully. The big boss cave. It was really a long day. Not so much for us, but for our fellow van lifers and neighbor for tonight. Um, poor guys. Poor guys, Monica and Bernard from Lithuania. So we know them from Facebook because we chat a lot from, I think, a couple of years now. And they just get stuck in the mud. So, oh, tonight we're gonna have pizza. Even if we don't have a oven, mm, we got a recipe. Well, magic happened, so now they're just near us. And that's just the trick. 
about that and it's low heat. Hello, hello, good morning. Come here. Morning. <laughs> we are on a bit. Yeah, you're. Uh -huh. you're yeah, I'm not too good, sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit chilly. Yesterday, Bernard came with the van and it got stuck in the mud for six hours. <laughs> no worries. So, lesson learned. Next time, the tip is if you go near a river or a lake or a place that it's kind of dirt roads, just stop the car walk a little bit and check how is the ground because the ground was muddy. Where you've been now? Uh, we have been in uh, Tarifa. Uh, I stayed there for like uh, six months, five months and then we was uh, tripping to Portugal all the coast to the uh, Lagos. Then we was going up to uh, this one uh, famous spot Zagres. Zagres okay and then we went straight away to Spain and stopping in the same spots like you stopping okay and it's really something interesting we don't like cities as well we don't we like don't it. like cities at all and the good thing is about meet up with fellow van lifer is that we, of course, we start to speak about solar panels and, you know, all the gears for the van and uh, the upgrade and things like that. And as well, we share places we like. So he told me about, uh, he showed me some picture about the place that it's kind of uh, full of solar panels. So it's really scenic, scenic. probably with the drone will be nice to yeah, take yeah, some footage the there. Uh, so the idea is every time it's nice to meet other travelers so you can share stories and, and places and a uh, good place where to go. So we got a giveaway here today because we need a little bit more space and we never use that much. We're gonna leave because probably he will need more than us to this insulation. Whoa! Yeah. So Ooh, this nice. is for made for a T4. Or that's the front one, I think. This is the the back one. And it's really easy to put it. You just put these vacuums on the holes that you got here. And these holes. Ring, and you just stick it to the window. So for the night. Yeah. That's it. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah. Really nice guy. <laughs> you should meet him. 1895 days on the road and today is serene. <laughs> 